Hey y'all, it's your girl Adori Asia, and I'm back with another video. Video, back with another video. Video for you hoes. Oh, and today, we are going to be attempting to do an e-girl inspired look. I say inspired look because I am not a professional. I don't have exactly all the products I need. I'm not beating my face, okay? So it's just inspired, as you can see. But I'm, I'm, I feel like I'm so cute or whatever. Just gonna, just gonna disclaimer, I am gonna let you know that there was a journey to get to this point, okay? Take one is terrible. And I'm gonna include it because I looked like a clown. Let's just be happy and excited that I made it to this. Before it got here, it got ugly real quick. But yeah, so stay tuned, keep watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. Let's get into this video. So about this e-girl look, I, I feel like I should make this disclaimer now. I am in no way a professional makeup artist. I am in no way a makeup artist. I in no way really know what I'm doing when it comes to putting on makeup. So, don't roast me in the comments. Thank you. You made your point. With that being said, I'm gonna start off with my Fenty primer. I don't really need it, but you know, why not? I have it, I spent money on it, and then I'm just gonna use it. <laughs> Next, I'm going to go in with my Fenty Matchstick in the color Suede. I am not a big fan of foundation, like I said in my previous makeup video, probably because I don't have my right foundation shade. So, conceal under my eyes, prime my lids, Bring it down into my cheek a little bit, above my mouth, my chin, all of my forehead. Then I'm gonna take my sponge, lightly blend it out, you know? Maybe one day I'll learn how to beat my face. But until then, this is what we stick into. All right, so that's all blended out. Next, I'm gonna do my brows. Anastasia, dip brow pomade in the color chocolate. The brows done, honey. So, e girl makeup is just a bunch of pink and eyeliner and hearts and whatever. So, the palette I'm going to be using today is the Jaclyn Hill palette, collaboration with Morphe, the Volume Two. I'm gonna bronze just a teeny, 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 teeny bit with this Morphe bronzer in the color Blogger. Looking real pale out here in these screeps. Out here in these quarantine screeps. So now that that's on, I am going to put some banana powder under my eye because this palette right here the fallout is real so it can catch the fallout nothing crazy you see and i'm not even going in with a transition color i usually go in with like a brownish type of color deal whatever but nope not today today we are gonna go in with, I don't know, there's so many to choose from. We're gonna go in with, are we just gonna go all out with Tipsy Girl? Are we gonna do some therapy sesh action? What we gonna do? Tipsy Girl, apparently.
Do do you see that fallout already? We're actually gonna go in with some therapy sesh, which is this like a lavender-ish purple on the lid. And another challenge that I have usually with doing my makeup, as you can see, there's my eyes crease so much. Like it's like the weirdest thing. Like I have like e extra skin around. It's so weird. Like you see how under here creases so much? And then you have my lid that creases. Like, is it a hooded lid? Not really, kind of. I also don't have a lot of real, like if I relax my eyes, I don't have a lot of real estate between my lid and my eyebrow. So it's like, my eyes are so small. <laughs> but if I go like this, that's when you're able to see everything. So it's like, okay. My eyes clearly was not made for eye makeup, but we're, we're gonna make it work. I recently just learned how to put on eyeliner, so please forgive me about how long this is about to take. Forgive me for how long this is about to take, that's what I'm gonna say. All right, here we go. We're, we're gonna, we're gonna get like a little smudger brush. And I'm going to go into this black color called Temptress in the palette. Okay, so I've never worked with black eyeshadow before, so <sighs> stressful. I look crazy. I don't like this. Nope. Nope. We're gonna start again. Okay. I'm back with a fresh face because that last look was going bad real quick. So, we're gonna do something that complements our skin complexion and style a little bit more. <laughs> so, first, so I'm gonna stick to what I know and what I do. I'm not gonna be a fraud, okay? I am, I usually go, I'm gonna go in with a transition color. I usually go in with Human Get It from Fenty Beauty's uh, Moroccan Spice palette. However, I feel like it's gonna be a little bit too dark. So I'm going to go in with Grateful, this color right here. It's similar to Human Get It, but it's a little bit lighter. All right, I'm actually happy this one is more of like a, has like more of an orange tone to it because I'm going for that peachy type of pink, which I should have done first. <laughs> we are going to go in with this color called Positivity. Positivity. What's T, sis? And to add just a tad pink, a tad of pink to it, I'm gonna go in with Lowly Mama or Lolly Mama. I'm gonna blend it out up here. I'm not mad at this. We are going to go in with this again. Now, blush. So I'm gonna go in with this color first from Ofra Cosmetics. It's just a little sample thing that I got from my Ipsy bag. So blush is the most important part of this look. I'm gonna go in with a little bit of this positivity actually, cause I love this color. We're gonna go in with this phase zero blush called Making Moves. And this one does have a little bit of a gold shimmer to it and make it double as like a highlight. Now we are gonna do the liner, but thinner. I'm gonna go in with another liner. Fenty again, Papaya Mama.
What I've learned from applying eyeliner is sometimes you just have to apply yourself. Like, it doesn't matter if you think you can do it or you think you can't. You have to try. Before, I would just be so afraid that I wouldn't even try. You have to be not afraid to mess up because when you mess up is when you learn from your mistakes, right? What you learn, you learn what not to do. You, you learn what works, you learn what doesn't work. Almost forgot, you gotta add the equal parts. I'm not really a big fan of like the fake freckle movement. <sighs> I have my reasons, but um, yeah, I'm not, no. Mm -mm. It's, for me, it's kind of like, I don't want to compare it to something extreme, but it's like, it's a feature that was frowned upon way back when and if you had it, you you were deemed to have like some type of skin condition or there was something wrong with you. And just taking that and just, the people who grew up during those times feeling so insecure about their freckles and things like that. And just to take that into now and you're applying it to your face. Yeah, it's, it's just not for me, you know. Glorifying it, it's like a weird type of appropriation, if you will. The highlight code. Hustler Baby by Fenty Beauty. Gonna highlight my cubits well. Gonna highlight my chin. Gonna highlight the tip of the nose. The bridge of the nose. Now, we're gonna get to lips. I have two colors. I have this old ass lip lipstick that I have. Don't even know the company name. Color design, maybe that's the company name. Love it, maybe that's the name of the shade. Or this Bella Pierre Cosmetics uh, in the shade Incognito. So we have this Bella Cosmetics, and then we have this no name, no shade, but. First, we're gonna go in with this lip pencil from NYX in the color Toast. First, we're gonna go with the OD but goodie because obviously that's all I got left, so. Now I'm gonna do my hair. Why do I always forget my mascara? Okay, mascara's on. Tell me what you guys think. Don't just, like I said, do not roast me because makeup, I'm not a professional. I don't necessarily know what I'm doing. I just, you know, try to make myself look cute or whatever. I do what works for me. And yeah, thank you. If you made it to the end of this video, like, share, subscribe. Like, subscribe. Those are the two most important things, you know. Turn on that notification bell so you know when I upload because I don't have a schedule. I just putting videos out there. Putting videos out there. I hope all y'all are good. Stay good, stay healthy. Keep those six feet. Cause we don't want no problems, okay? Okay. Bye.